सदाशिवसमारंभा शंकराचार्य मध्यमा अस्मदाचार्य पर्यता वंदे गुरुपरंपरा श्रुतिस्मृतिपुराणा आलय करुणाल नमा भगवत्द शंकर लोकशंक शंकर शंकराचार्य केशव बादरायण सूत्र भाष्य वंदे भगवत पुनः पुनः ईश्वरो गुरुरात्मे मूर्ति भेद विभागिने व्योम व्याप्त देहाय दक्षिणाूर्त नम सहनावोतु सहनौ भुनक्त सह वीरकरवाह तेजस्वीतमस्तुमा वह ओं शात शात शाति धातुर्ब्रह्म संप्रोक्त जीव आख्यात्य प्रकृतिसुबंतादिर्धातुब्रह्मात्म नम नारायण परो व्यक्ता दंडमुव्यक्त संभव अंडस्यांत मे लोका सप्तद्वीपा चे दिनी We saw the sixth verse. The third verse is the Surya, the Shashanko, the Pavaka, the Yadgatvan, the Nivartante, the Dhamma, the Paramamma, the Mama. So whatever idea was conveyed in the fifth verse, the same continues in the sixth verse as to the Swarupa, Bhagwan Swarupa, which is called as Dhamma here. Having attained that, yet dhamma vaishnavam padam, the goal. Having attained the goal, one does not come back to samsara, and that goal is prakashatmaka, where surya, shashanka, pavaka, none of these can reveal. They themselves being objects revealed by atma, they do not reveal the atma. They are revealed by atma. So that was the sixth verse. Who wants to take the seven, seventh verse? <clears throat> Anyone? Yeah, I can try. Yeah. The yat gatva na nivartante ityuktam ityuk. क्वेश्चन सो भगवान इज सेइंग यद गत्वान निवर्तन्ते सो देयर इज गमना इन्वॉल्व एंड इफ गमना इज इन्वॉल्व सर्वाहि गति ही वेयर एवर गति इज इन्वॉल्व आगत्यांता देयर इज टू बी आगति आल्सो गति एंड आगति इज अ सीक्वेंस यू कैन नॉट हैव गति एंड नॉट हैव आगति देयरफॉर यद गत्वान निवर्तन्ते इज क्वेश्चनेबल and it is well known prasiddham what <coughs> yoga viprayoganta ha there is always association and dissociation there always association with a <coughs> dhama also if one has gati unto another loka then there has to be viprayoga also if there is sanyoga by gati There has to be prayoga by agati. It is prasiddham. Therefore, katham katham uchchate tadham gatanam nasti nivrutti hi tadham gatanam. Those who have this should be a samasa tadham. Oh, uh, it's okay. Tadham is separate. Also, it's okay. Gatanam is separate. So tad tad gatanam tad gatham gatanam nivrutti hi katham nasti. How can there be 
no nivrutti there has to be punaravrutti that is the idea there what can be that goal from where you don't come back it has to be continuously going to a particular <coughs> and going elsewhere then shunu tatra karanam what is the reason behind that please listen to that says bhagwan in the seventh verse yeah mamai vamsho jeeva loke jeeva bhuta sanatanah मनशट्टानी प्रकृति स्थानी कर्षति सो दिपद मम एव अंश जीवलोके जीवभूत सनातन मन षा इंद्रिया प्रकृति स्थानी कर्षति and then i'm back on the, <laughs> the new the new the new laptop yes oh with great effort i was uh, on the new laptop with uh, the i was used to the keyboard and the and now i have to come back to the pc keyboard it's uh, counted off mana shashta indriyani pratisthani karshatiya no pad so go on with the uh, cases the uh, cases karshati uh, will be uh, prathama ek varsha ek vachana प्रथम पुरुष या प्रथम पुरुष एक वचन मम षष्टि एक वचन एव व्यय अंश प्रथम एक वचन प्रथम विभक्ति एक वचन जीवलोके सप्तमी एक वचन जीवभूत अगेन प्रथम प्रथम विभक्ति एक वचन सनातन से मन टू थ्री सारी मन इज नॉट सेपरेट पद Yeah. Okay. Mana is not a separate. Mana has sastan indriyani is one pada. Yeah. So two three. Yeah. Prakriti sthani is also two three. Karshati. Yeah. So karshati so, is cross. Karshati is cross. That is the tingantam padam. So yeah. who it cross? This sanatana ha kartari prayoga. Therefore, mama eva amusha. Jiva loke yeah. yaha mama amusha. सह जीवभूत सनातन सह कर्षति देन किं कर्षति और कानी कर्षति व्हाट डज ही विड्रॉ द जीवा हु इज माय अंश सेस भगवान इन द जीवलोक जीवलोक इज वेयर एवर देयर इज जीवा दैट इज जीवलोक एंड एवरीवेयर देयर इज आई मीन लोका कैन नॉट बी नोन अनलेस जीवा इज देयर हु विल नो द लोका देयर हैज टू बी जीवा टू ऑब्जेक्टिफाई दैट लोका लोक्यंते इति लोका दोस लोकास आर दोस व्हिच आर ऑब्जेक्टिफाइड एक्सपीरियंस एक्सपीरियंसर हैज टू बी देयर दैट हैपेंस टू बी जीवा एंड जीवा इज भगवानस अंशा अंशा इज नॉट लिटरल अंशा बिकॉज हैविंग बीन लिमिटेड बाय द शरीर सो सो टू से लिमिटेड ही विल बी सीन एज अंशा सो जीवत्वेन अंशा एव jiva as a as an ausha because he has jivatva bhava individuality individuality and totality cannot be compared at all therefore ausha ausha definitely an ausha the upadhi is small the ichha shakti is small kriya shakti is small jnana shakti is small this alpa jiva will always be ausha That kind of jiva, jiva loke, jiva bhuta, jiva bhuta is jiva tum prapta ha. One who has attained this jiva tum, you can mute yourself. Yeah. So the one who has attained jiva tum bhava, he is sanatana do. If you look at it, anadi, jiva is anadi, and if you look at chaitanya tum of jiva, chaitanya, which is the real sorup of jiva, that is anadi anyway. so even if you look at jiva as not just chaitanya but with the upadhi whereby individualized there thereby he is in a loka has a particular desha has jivatva bhava and thereby is an ausha of bhagwan is timeless anyway sanatanah chiratanah chirantanah is always an ausha that ausha for whom there is a srishti and 
because he has been a karta this shrishti has to provide him opportunity for bhoga for which he has worked across janmas that kind of jiva is ma- is connected to sharira sharira traya jivatva bhava is due to avidya that avidya is karana sharira then based on the particular experience due bhog bhoga due there is such bhogya prapancha created and for that bhogya prapancha part of that bhogya prapancha to be in line with the bhogas of which are due to the jiva that jiva will take a particular stool uh, sharira and the sukshma sharira will be configured in that manner to fit the stool sharira whether it is prani sharira vruksha sharira pakshi kitaha deva rakshasa manushya and then genders also linga in so many varieties these stool shariras are created and in that stool in those stool shariras based on the bhoga due one connects a jiva thereby there is a particular configuration of the indriya and manaha however currently the shastra is focused towards manushya therefore manashashte shashtani indriyani prakriti sthani karshati will come to karshati but what happens is the jiva has these manushya jiva has six indriyas which are the six indriyas generally not necessarily indriya manaha can be taken as indriya can be said as mind is backing the five indriyas but along with the indriyas the manah is counted so this is this is seen in both ways mind as an inner instrument which is not a karana but as antakarana also a karana so if you take it as karana then the sixth or if you take as uh, not an indriya if you don't take it as an indriya antakarana but not an indriya rupa karana then also it can be the sixth this is the sixth along with the five indriyas mind is counted as a six so in the samasa mind along with the six indriyas that is the samasa there prakriti sthani which are prakriti sthani means uh, they are um, i mean it, it's quite literal we can take as which are in the prakriti prakriti sthitani so uh, prakriti sthani i'm thinking of samasa prakriti sthani would be prakriti stha prakriti stha is uh, upapada but uh, as which kind of a karma upapada or adhikarana hmm. pratisthani nustha is there stha can be here prakriti is a is a different I'll, i'll have to look up the tika uh, the bhashya but prakriti is uh, swasthane yeah so prakriti sthani is swasthane so prakriti is taken as uh, it's one so, sons uh, swabhava so sw, swasthane Uh, whatever is their own prakriti in there so prakriti is taken as a very has a very uh, different meaning here not uh, so golaka is the artha there prakriti sthani therefore golaki sthitani these manashashtani indriyani they have their own golakas so prakriti has a very uh, different meaning here it is uh, literally it was not working so bhashyakara says it is swasthane swasthane shrutra indri shrutra dini swasthane means what wherever whichever indriya has a golaka there alone that indriya will function so in each and every receptacle these will be there so prakriti has a meaning of golaka or receptacle therefore swasthane and then it is the implied meaning is karna shashkulyado prakrutau sthitani upapada tatpurusha all right but prakriti meaning is shrotradini uh, shrotradini Uh, Shotradi 
the naam golakani those which are the golakas of these okay so coming back to this uh, karshati so what happens karshati withdraws when will the jiva withdraw the sense organs etc when he has to travel from this tula sharira into another desha which is continuing from the this gati which was talked about so this gati if gati is taken as literal then the jiva is withdrawing these sense organs and the uh, sense organs where the mind is the sixth those he has he is withdrawing into his own assemblage and then he is going to travel to another loka or another sharira thereby karshati withdraws and even when manifesting into another sharira he has to expand there so this will by uh, going with the context we have to say that when the travel is involved from one loka to another or one sharira to another then he withdraws and then gets into another sharira then they expand based on the stoola sharira they expand and they interact with the vishayas now at the end of this journey end meaning jnanena moksha that kind of an end of the journey when advaita jnana is attained that time what happens is that he withdraws them completely like in nitya pralaya in pralaya and while traveling the way he withdraws but then what is going to happen is that withdraws in a the sense there all the components are withdrawn into their own karanas and then there is no travel involved that is gati which is jnana rupa gati that is the real idea there yat gatvana nivartante anyway so that being the case here uh, we'll go to the bhashya let's do the anvaya jeeva loke so we start with the saptami jeeva loke jeeva loke सनातन जीवभूत सनातन भाष्यकार से ममेवत्म नारायण से अंश इज भाग और अवयव अ पार्ट अ मिनिस्क्यूल पार्ट मीनिंग एक देश सो यू गिव्स मेनी मिनिज अंश इज अ भाग जनरल ये भाग विच इज अ पार्ट अवयव देन एक देश नाउ दिस कांट बी लिटरल इफ इट इज लिटरल इफ भगवान से इज माय अंश देन भगवान विल बी एन अंशी मीनिंग ही विल बी अवयवी an avayavi ishwara who is made up of parts uh, if it is literal if he is made up of parts then he will also have an end ishwara will have an end forget jeeva we'll say okay we are uh, aushas we are aushas of parmatma if we are really aushas of parmatma if it is literal then ishwara will be antavan he will also have vikriyas and all vikriyas with wear and tear will Make Ishwar also with her away. That can't be true. Therefore, Aunsha is not literal. Anyway, this will be questioned. It will come in Bhashya again. Iti arthantaram jiva loke, jiva anam loke. So iti arthantaram, meaning Aunsha is also known as bhaga, avayava, ekadesha. All these ideas are there. Jiva loke means jiva anam loke, meaning samsara. In samsara. wherever it is there jiva bhutah who is this jiva bhutah jivatvam prapta who is that karta 
भोक्ता इति प्रसिद्ध वेल नोन एज कर्ता भोक्ता कि सनातन मीन चिरंतन हि इज टाइमलेस यथा जल सूर्य कहा सूर्यांश जल निमित्तापाय सूर्य गत्वा न निवर्तते न निवर्तते च तेन आत्मना गति यथा जल सूर्य कहार दर इज कन् प्रत्यय इज यूज रेर यूजेज ई मीन रेर इन देंस वी डोंट सी मच ऑफ दिस इन वेदांत जल सूर्य का इज दिस कन् प्रत्यय इवाथे मीनिंग लाइक सो जल जलगत सूर्य इव दैट इज हाउ यू हेव टू अंडरस्टैंड दिस लाइक दी सूर्य इन जल मीनिंग रिफ्लेक्शन प्रतिबिंब इत सूर्यांश दि प्रतिबिंब ऑफ सूर्य इज कॉल एज सूर्यांश तद्वत जस्ट लाइक अ प्रतिबिंब ऑफ सूर्य इन जल कैन बी कॉल्ड एज सूर्यांश इज नॉट रियली अ पार्ट नॉट रियली भाग अवयव एक और अंश नन ऑफ दीज words is really fitting but then literally if you don't take the ansha it can be called as ansha surya ansha in the jala is called as uh, is the pratibimba really that kind of surya ansha what is the jeeva narayana narayanasya ansha what happens is surya ansha सूर्यांश जल निमित्तापाय सूर्य गर्तते सो द क्वेश्चन विच वॉज आस यदत्न निवर्तंते हाउ कैन इट बी दैट एटेनिंग अ पर्टिक्युलर गति देर इज नो आ गति सो दैट इज एक्सप्लेन हियर विद दी एक्सापल अदरवाइज सी वॉट इज हैपनिंग हियर के नॉट बी अंडरस्टूड हाउ इज इट how is it answering that question it is answering that question is because jeeva is my ansha what kind of ansha ansha is not literal otherwise bhagwan will be avayavi bhagwan is not avayavi we know that then what kind of ansha that ansha is pratibimbatvena ansha just like the surya ansha in jala Similarly, there is pratibimba in the antak karna of Ishara who is considered as jiva. Ishara in the sense we say actually Chaitanya Rupa Ishara. That Brahma Chaitanya reflects in antak karna, thereby one becomes jiva. As do so that is the ansha there, jalani mitta pai. And then how is it there is no there there is no gati, there is no gati. Uh, there is no agati he after attaining me says said bhagwan earlier there is no agati he punaha na nivartante how is it so just like this surya ansha when jala goes away jala is the nimitta nimitta apaye naimitta naimittikasya apaya so when nimitta goes away the suryamsha which has come up the pratibimba which has come up due to jala when jala goes away then there is no nimitta for the reflection pratibimba then where did the pratibimba go if if you ask where did the pratibimba go where did it come from in the first place the pratibimba came due to the surya's rays falling in on the jala jala goes away then the pratibimba is is withdrawn onto the same surya uh, same surya through this sun rays where else is it gone this the sun rays cannot be without the surya the sun manifests its prakasha through the sun rays then there is a pratibimba due to that where did the pratibimba go if we inquire into it pratibimba went away into the same sun rays and same sun the pratibimba was never separate from the sun really so where did it go away it went back to the sun 
So Surya Amsha went back to the Surya. If the Surya Amsha went back to Surya, then there is Gati involved. Is there really Gati involved? Not really. But then, having merged back with Surya, there is Gati involved also. Therefore, figurative usage, if you look at it, Surya Amshaha attained Surya. That Gati is like the Gati which was mentioned earlier. Yad Gatva Nanivartante. The Surya Amsha is not going to come back from Surya once it, it merges figuratively. Why? Because the Jalanimitta was there. The Jalanimitta, if it is gone away completely, then there won't be any Agatihi. So Surya Meva Gatva Nanivartate. Surya Amshaha. Surya Amsha does not come back again having attained Surya. Similarly, Teneva Atmana Gachati, meaning remains in the same form. Atmana, there is, it is reflexive. In the same form. Which form? Surya Teneva. Teneva Atmana Gachati means goes into Surya as Surya. Then there is no separation possible and there is no Agatihi possible because it is one Surya who is not going to travel anymore as such into Jala. Eva Meva similarly is the Gati of Jiva when Jiva figuratively merges with Ishara. Yatha Ghatadjupadi Parichinno Ghatadjakasha Akasham Shasan Ghatadi Nimittapai Akasham Prapin and your Tate. Eva Meva Tadwatu. Another example given is Ghatadi Upadi Parichinnaha Ghatadi Akasha. The pot space is never different from the Akasha, which is Mahakasha. But then the Pot which gives the bhranti of pot space, the body of the pot, akasha, akasha se amsha san, that ghata akasha is akasha amsha, as though. Then, when ghata dinimitta pai, when the upadi ghata is taken away, where did the ghata akasha go? Ghata akasha merged back with the mahakasha, akasham prapyan anivartate. So both examples are given, Avachedavada as well as Pratibhimbavada by Bhagavan Bhashyakara. So both are valid. Vivarana uses the Pratibhimbavada, whereas, or Abhasavada also, whereas Bhamatikara uses the Avachedavada. Ataha upapanna muktam yadgatva nanivartante iti. Therefore, what has been said is valid because gati is not literal. Now the question is, this amsha has been talked about. Nanu niravayasya paramatmanah kutavayavah ekadesha amsha iti. Okay, you have given many meanings, that is fine, but then how can there be amsha of the niravayava paramatma? There cannot be any avayava. Therefore, ekadesha amsha, whatever you call as arthantara, that is not possible in Paramatma. Savayatvecha vinasha prasangaha avayava vibhaga. Because avayavas are subject to wear and tear. They will have friction with each other. They will fall apart from each other. Then the whole will also fall apart. So, Jiva has trouble with another Jiva Amsha, then Ishwara will fall apart. Does that happen? It is ridiculous to even think about that. Savayavatve, if there is Avayatvam, if Bhagavan is along with Avayavas, then Vinasha Prasanga Kasya Paramatmanaha. Paramatma will undergo Vinasha because of Avayava Vibhaga. Naisha dosha, so Bhagavan Bhashyakara answers, Naisha dosha, it is not an issue because it is not literal. Avidya krutopadi parichinna ekadesha, amshayva kalpito yataha. 
अंश एव कल इट इज नॉट अंश लिटरली अविद्या कृत उपाधि परछिन्न दी परछिन्न लिमिटेडनेस ऑफ जीवा इज ड्यू टू दि उपाधि विच इज दि शरीर उपाधि विच इज अविद्या मैनिफेस्टेशन ऑफ अविद्या एज दि फस्ट शरीर एंड देन दि लेटर टू कारण कारण शरीर एंड देन देर आर टू मोर शरीर सूक्ष्म एंड स्थूल दे मेक दि जीवा फील दैट ही इज जीवा लिमिटेड बाय दि बॉडी मैंड सेंस कॉम्प्लेक्स दर्शित अयम अर्थ क्षेत्राध्याय विस्तरश If this doubt comes back again and again to the Puru Pakshi, Bhagwan Bhaskara says, refer the thirteen chapter. It has been discussed there, Vistara Shah, in detail. Such a jiva ha madam shatve na kalpita ha katham samusarati utkramati chaiti uchchate. If that jiva is imagined as my ansha and is not really an ansha at all. then how can he have samsara how can he take janma and how can he utkrama meaning ut- utkrama is the gati whereby he leave the sharira and then travel manashashtani indriyani shrotradini prakritisthani swasthane karna shashkulyado prakrutau sthitani karshati akarshati so samsara is possible only when this kalpita jeeva associates with these indriyas along with the antakarana indriyas are shrutradi indriyas prakritisthani we have seen earlier swasthane those which are there indriyas which are there in their own golakas which are karana shashkulyado in the sockets of ear etc prakritau sthitani being in those indriyas uh, sorry being in those indriya golakas indriyas along with mind one withdraws and travels that jiva when he withdraws associates and withdraws for withdrawing he has to have identification first then then alone he can withdraw these are mine i need to go so you know you you, uh, you stay at some place you have, you have your things spread around and then you you have to gather all them all of them when you have to travel similarly indriyas are you know are going out through these uh, through the uh, being based in the sockets but then they travel to the vishayas they have to be gathered back so that one can leave the body and go to another body or loka so karshati akarshati means withdraws Now the question is Kasmin Kale. Who wants to take this? Hello, I can try. Yes, Amma. Kasmin Kale. Okay. Shariram. Shariram. Yada vapnoti. Yacha pyutkrama tishvaraha. Grihi tvaitani samyati. Vayur gandha ni vashayat. Okay. Okay. So. There are two kriya padas. Padas che da first amma. Ah, padas. Okay. Shariram yat avapnoti yat yat utkramati ishvara ha grahit yat cha api yat. Oh, sorry. Yat cha yat cha api utkramati ishvara ha grahitva. इव वायुर्गंधा 
there is aikara there is a vriddhi so vriddhi radai is is applied there oh. eh vayu gandhan ashayat okay so avakloki gandhan gandhan ashayat what about the e where is it gandhani gandhaniva sorry gandhaniva ashaya so this eva got shifted there earlier <laughs> yeah. then no uh, ashaya okay okay so there are two kriya padas you know three actually apnoti then utkramati and mm-hmm. samyati then shariram will be uh, dvitiya ekavachana okay then yet yet that also dvitiya ekavachana yet here is uh, it can be taken as avya here okay yeah it can be it can be dvitiya also but here it makes more sense to take avya based on the bhashya otherwise it's uh, okay. not clear i then cross check again chapi yet chapi yet chapi then Check this. Right. Kramati. Then Ishwara will be one one. Uh, Prathama Ekavachana. Yet is here. Yet yet is yada. So therefore it's an avya. Yeah. Yet cha. Yet cha avya ya. Apni avya ya. Again. Mm, yet, uh, so because the question is question is kasmin kali. So kasmin kali will not be answered if yet is taken as. Uh, that it's better to take as a view. Okay, anyway. Yada yada arthe. Then yacha api utramati ishraha ishraha one one. So tamai ka vachana grahitva will be again avyaya. Then etani will be dvitiya bahu vachana. then vayu ganda and that also will be dvitiya and bahu vachana vayu eka vachana and ganda and bahu vachana then eva avyaya and ashaya panchami eka vachana to so, here yat yat shariram yat is yada yada yat is avya yada shariram avapnuti yada so the answer is kasmin kale यदा शरीरम वापनोति देन व्हाट तदा तदा मनश्चष्टानि इंद्रियानि प्रकृतिस्थानि करिष्यति शष्टानि इंद्रियानि आई एम नॉट स्प्लिट दिस मना इज नॉट सेपरेट बट शष्टानि सेपरेट इंद्रियानि शष्टानि इंद्रियानि मनश्चष्टानि इंद्रियानि या there sandhi vichheda was not done okay so kada so akarshati kada akarshati karshati ja kare when does he withdraw yada shariram vaapnoti when one attains sharira jeeva jeeva bhuta sanatana attains sharira that time he manashashtani indriyani prakritisthani karshati he withdraws the so, prakriti sthani is prakriti sthani these are golakas they are present in the golakas from golakas he has to withdraw because golakas belong to the stula sharira whereas indriya belongs to the sukshma sharira sukshma sharira has to leave the stula sharira for another loka prapti or another sharira prapti therefore stula sharira prapti therefore from golakas he has to withdraw so the indriyas which are present in the stula sharira golakas he has to withdraw if they are you know hanging around in vishayas also it has to be withdrawn that is the withdrawal which is taking place every time but then when he is traveling that time from the stula sharira golakas he has to withdraw then uh, yacha and yacha is yadacha again yadacha api what utkramati avapti utkramati when one attains the sharira or when one leaves the sharira that time oh, one has to gather the belongings those are indriyas manaha also that time what 
शरीर then he becomes jiva as do again okay? all figure it so it's there in one cannot go wrong in gita it bhagwan bhashyakara uh, has can misinterpret you know that is a puro paksha puro paksha we say no your advaitins are misinterpreting but what about krishna he says ishara yat shariram aapnoti avapnoti utkramati then How can Ishara attain Sharira? There, we have to understand that uh, Bhagwan Bhaskara has the entire Shastra in perspective. That is why Ishara ha and Jiva there is no bhed. There is no grihitwa, etani grihitwa sanyati. Have we attained this? Etani grihitwa Ishara ha. यशरीर ईश्वर वापनोति वायु इव वी कैन से वायु गंधान वायु आशया गंधान इव वायु वायु आशया गंधान वायु इव सो वायु इव आशया गंधान डिफिकल्ट वायु आशया आशया इत्यादि fragrant whatever is fragrant from there gandhan grihitva having grasp the gandha from flowers why you what sanyati why you go and travels why you travels having gathered gandha from ashaya from flowers i am just saying it flowers any any fragrant thing If the vayu is flowing then how vayu gathers the fragrance and then travels similarly ishara ka what etani grihitva ivo ishara ka etani grihitva sanyati etani all these which have gone early which are those these manasthani indriyani pragudisthani gathers and travels that is the idea here yat shariram avapnoti क्षेत्र क्षेत्र चापी मां विद्धि 
सर्वक्षेत्रेशु शरीरेशु भारत सो देहादि संगात स्वामी इस क्षेत्र ज्ञा हुए जीश्वरा हुए इस कॉल्ड है जीवा तदा कर्षति सो यदा यत्तिस्य अज यदा यदा all this takes place तदा कर्षति इति श्लोकस्य द्वितीय पाद द्वितीय पाद ह अर्थवशात प्राथम ये न संबद्ध दे तो दिस सेकेंड पाद कनेक्ट्स विद दी फर्स्ट एस दी फर्स्ट as the first in a sense it should connect before in the order it should be reordered uh, so ishara jeeva sharira utkramati yachapi shariram avapnoti ishara then tada karshati we can can say vayu gandhan grihitva aashaya sanyati iv similarly this ishara who is jeeva jeeva roopa ishara now that ishara who is jeeva now jeeva bhuta sanatana he travel sanyati so you have to reorder the words therefore bhagwan bhashya karan is ishara which has been mentioned here in the yachapi utkramati ishara so this should go earlier in the anvaya why because of arthavasha because the meaning will not be revealed otherwise so arthavasha under the influence of artha we we need to know the artha not the krama so artha artha the sequence of artha krama rather artha krama not the shabda krama but artha krama is superior baliyan has more strength paata kramat artha kramao baliyan by that nyaya artha vasha is there therefore vidya pada should be taken earlier pratham yena sambadhyate means as the first as the first it will connect in the anvaya therefore here ishara uh, we can reorder i mean in anvaya you can paste it any which way but then ईश्वरा इज व्हाट यत शरीरम वापनोति ईश्वरा तो ईश्वरा शुड कनेक्ट विद ऑल ऑफ दिस तो ईश्वरा शुड गो अर्लियर यच्चापि उत्क्रामति ईश्वरा हु ईश्वरा हाउ वायु आशयात गंधान गृहित्वा इव सिमिलरली एतानि गृहित्वा संयाति सो एनी वे दिस नीड मोर वर्क in the anvaya this is okay but then ishara can be brought in earlier and uh, taken as karta in each of these along with each of these ver- verbs singantam padam along with all the padas one can take ishara as the karta there and ishara who is jeeva also you can uh, since the jeeva word is not there it should be interpreted as jeeva when one associates with the sharira यदा च पूर्वस्मा शरीर शरीरांतर अवाप्नोति सो यदा व्हेन शरीर शरीरांतर पूर्वस्मा शरीर फ्रॉम द अर्लियर शरीर वन टेक्स अनदर शरीर तदा दैट टाइम एतानि मनश्रष्टा इंद्रिया विच हैज गॉन बाय इन द अर्लियर श्लोक गृहीवा हैविंग टेकन दम संयाति मीन सम्यक्याति गति संयाति सम्यक्याति travels uh, in keeping with the karma that is the samyak there kim you were like what like vayu vayu is pavanah the wind gandhani vashat pushpadehe from the fragrance uh, from the uh, pavanah gandhani va sanyati so samyak yati gachyati the vayu carries along fragrance in a similar manner jeeva will carry along indriyas okay next wants to try this nobody is taking it i can take it no i can try this the simple one yeah it's a uh, one line <laughs> online so kaani uh, kaani punah taani iti yeah so what are punah taani yeah what are these manashashtani indriyani श्रोत्र चक्षुस्पर्शन चसनम ग्रहण 
അധിഷ്ഠായ മനസ്ചായം വിഷയാനുപസേവതെ സ്വതി പരച്ഛതായി ശ്രോത്രം ചക്ഷു സ്പർശ സ്പർശം സ്പർശനം സോറി സ്പർശനം ച രസനം ഘ്രാണം ഏവ അധിഷ്ഠായ മന ച അയം വിഷയാൻ ഉപസേവതെ സോദി വർബ് ഇസ് ഉപസേവതെ പ്രഥമായ ക്വസ്റ്റന ദൻ ശ്രോത്രം ചക്ഷു സ്പർശനം രസനം ഘ്രാണം ദേ ആർ ഓൾ വൺ വൺ അധിഷ്ഠായ മീൻസ് ആക്ച്വലി അധിഷ്ഠായ <laughs> ഹാവിംഗ് ഡൺ സംതിങ് ഐഡന്റിഫൈഡ് വിത്ത് ഓർ ഹാവിംഗ് presided over or having some kind of association whatever you take the meaning of yap here these all will become second case oh this all become second case then at this time so if your cases are wrong so because you uh, have to start with see shrotras do not uh, do upasevana of vishaya they are jada jada cannot enjoy jada you have seen many times in the bhashya empty jada needs a chetana for as an upasevana being done by a chetana vastu jada cannot hmm. have anything to do with jada so guna gune to vartante all right but then they interact with each other upasevana is not possible upasevana is possible only for chetana never can a jada is always for the purpose of chetana never is jada for the purpose of jada therefore ghanam all of these who is it for all these are for the purpose of the upabhog of the jeeva sharira stula sharira is the adhikarana for upabhoga and sukshma sharira is the sadhana for upabhoga this is tattva bodha so manaha also taking on manaha the two one ayam 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 is also two one who is this ayam ayam is the karta yes. ഉപസേവത്തെ <laughs> supply supply is there you have to start from upasevate with upasevate if you directly correct shrotram it would work however grammatically it would work but then as soon as you land on adishthaya adishthaya so you have to say shrotram something adishthaya that will not work therefore vishayan upasevate if vishayan is the karma for upasevate otherwise you have to bring this as uh, karma to adishthaya uh, it will go all wrong so i am 
If it is not there, then Jiva has to be brought back here from Ishwara Jiva. There should be Anuritti. Because okay. I am is that I am is what? I am is a pronoun. It can be used yeah. only for a noun which has gone by. The I am is the form of Tat. Uh, uh, hmm. Of uh, uh, you say that this very uh, uh, Ishwara or Jiva, any noun which has gone by. So there I am. Vishayan Upasevate. So what is the Anvaya here? First I am. I am. Vishayan Upasevate. Yeah, that is the Anvaya. Upasevate. Who is that? Jeeva. Mm -hmm. And then how? Upasevate Adishthaya. Adishthaya. All of these. Shrotram Chakshu Rasanam Dhranam. And then. Rasanam. Rasanam. Shrotram Chakshu Rasanam Rasanam Dhranam Manaha. Adikthaya Vishayan Upasevate. Very simple otherwise. Shrotram Chakshu Sparshanam Cha. Sparshanam is all this Tvagendriyam. So Sparsha is Tvagendriyam. Rasanam Dhranam Eva Cha Manas Shashtam. Shashtam why? Because it has been said Shashtani. Manas Shashtani. So mind is the sixth among which Indriyas, those Indriyas. So that is the Manaha which is Shashta said to be earlier. Pratyekam. Indriyena saha. This is Manascha Shastam Pratyekam Indriyena saha. Along with each and every Indriya. There is Adishthaya. Adishthaya is what? Having become this Dehastha. Dehastha. Adishthaya is Dehastha San. How does one connect with the Manaha and Indriyas? Becoming Dehastha. This Ishara, how does he become Jiva? Jiva Bhuta, how? By associating with the Sharira. Sharira is what? Sukshma Sharira as Manaha and all the Stula Sharira which have Indriyas. These are just samplings. Need not be only these five. But we can talk about the others also. But then there is no Upasevana there. Uh, you know, one uh, they are called uh, karma indriyas. Karma indriyas will lead to upasevana through the jnana indriyas. Jnana indriyas are the inputs. Karma indriyas are, so to say, outputs. There. They are. They will help you gather the data for data or all the vishayas for what for one's own bhoga. But these bhogas are possible only only through the jnana indriyas. Karmendriyas are tools to get Vishayas for Jnanendriyas and through Jnanendriyas one consumes. Therefore, those are listed here and associating with them, them one does Bhoga. Upasevana is Bhoga there. Vishayan, what are the Vishayas? Shabda Adhin. Shabda Sparsha, Rupa Rasagandha, all one partakes of. Then the next we will see in the next part. Huh? Evam Dehagatam Dehat. So traveling from one Deha to another Deha. That is the entire Gati, which has which is where the questioning and the discussion began. Okay. Narayana Paruvyakta Andam Avyakta Samanam Andasyantastimi Roka Sapta Jeepa Chami Dini. Any questions? I have I have a small question. Yeah. In the in the eighth uh, uh, eighth bhashya, uh, Deha the Sangha Sanghata Swami, can you explain again how it is uh, Jiva equal to Jiva? Ishara, Ishara I, and Ish Ishara is there in the Mula, right? right. Deha the Sangata Swami, who is the Swami? Swami one who decides. Uh, Swami is one is a master, right? Master, yeah. Master of what? This Samasa is what Swami, Kasya Swami, Sangata Swami. Sangata is assemblage. Assemblage of what again? Again, there is a Shashti Akamsha. Hmm. Kasya Sangata or Kesham Sangata. Assemblage of what all? Dehadi, Deha, Indriya, all this. This is what we call as body mind sense complex. So, body mind sense complex is ruled over by someone. As I said, the Deha, Indriya, the Sushira uh -huh. and the Stula Sharira, all these Indriyas are what? They are Jada. They are assembled, assembled, assembled for the purpose of whom? For the purpose of the Swami who is sentient entity. 
now the sentient entity for whom the dehadi sangata is created is none other than jiva who is a samsari therefore swami is of the dehadi sangata is jiva okay okay see hmm. whose purpose does the dehadi sangata serve swami is what swami is one who to who somebody serves a purpose is a master right so hmm, master. master is is one who has these as servants so servants are dehadi they serve the swami Yeah. So they are created. They are assembled together to serve a purpose. That purpose is bhoga, and therefore they serve the Swami, the Master, who is Jiva. In fact, yeah. Jiva is the one for whom the entire uh, entire creation exists. Okay. Ishara has no other role to play otherwise. Why is he creating? Not because he has no other work to do. He has no work to do really. <laughs> Ishara has only one work. Whatever Jiva has been doing to keep notes and then give him what is due. For that, there is creation needed. He does not want to create. It is not Lila. Lila is all uh, Purana. He is basically keeping account of Jiva, all the Jivas, and Jiva is uh, uh, the entire samsara, entire. Uh, Jagat is tailor made for each and every jiva. This is what you right. want, right? So jiva right. ordered it. Ishwara says very compassionately, okay, this is what you wanted. Let me serve you that. So Ishwara is also serving the jiva by okay. by giving compassionately whatever he wants. So although Ishwara is a master, if you look at it, he is also, you know, the 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 way the bhaktas say, bhaktas can ask anything from Ishwara. Why? Because he uh, sure will listen to them they are not only the servants of the lord they also ask the lord to give them whatever they want and the ishwara also serves his devotees so there is that kind of a sambandha also between jiva and ishwara as an individual if you look at it therefore ishwara is creating this dihadi sangata not for his own purpose he is creating it for jiva there ishwara Having created this dehadi sangata, enters that as jiva. Okay. So, um, which has been said as you know, tadeva shrutva, uh, tadeva nu pravishat, tadeva nu pravishat. So, having created, he enters that as how oh, jiva bhavi na. Okay. Anu pravishya. Having then after that there is all havoc. <laughs> then that Ishwara yeah. is gone. You know, Ishwara is yeah. there only as long as. He has not entered the sharira as jiva. Okay. Okay. Anything Thank else? You. Anyone else? Okay. Namaste. Namaste. Hello.